you have a very balanced attack, right? I mean, people are always super impressed with, like you said, you were fastest swim, fastest run, and you were right there on the bike. Do you, a lot of people sort of, especially age groupers training for Ironmans, they leave very, very little time for swimming because it's such a small percentage of the race, right? But can you talk about how you balance your training a little bit? I can. And it's so funny you say that um, because for me, you know, I do the most volume in swimming. Uh, Let me break that down. Mostly, like I looked at, once again, my log, and I actually swam 8K the Friday before Vineman uh, at the Purple Bus Swim where I saw Rob because... I get there, and the way I've worked since I was, I can remember, 13, 14 years old, my, like, Meredith time and just quiet, no talking, stare at the black line, thinking time, is just swimming. And we call it, Matt and I call it MBK swims, where he'll just, like, today I had a 5K MBK swim. Literally, nothing. Just swim up and down like a hamster. And that kind of helped me, I think, I've been doing that for so long I feel like it helps me mentally. Like it's just my time. I can do up to 10k like that if you wanted. Obviously, that's not something you do every day. But when I swim, so I do a lot of MBK swims throughout the week. But key sessions for me are three, to, two to three times a week. Um, yeah, I might do a 4k MBK in that, but then the other 4k or what, whatever it is, is intensity and swimming with people faster than you. So I swim with those team Rich and the team Everyman Jack guys that are that are a little bit faster than me and I try like a squirrel trying to get a nut just to hang on and that has helped my swimming evolution for sure. Um, but it's funny giving advice and as a coach myself giving advice to age groupers, they don't need all that volume. They don't. But they need to make time to swim. But they they're better off doing 3 to 4k, maybe 3k intensity fast stuff, getting used to takeout speed. Um, For me, it's just my chi time, my yoga time. I don't stretch much, and that seems to be my stretch time too. But yeah, for those people, they need to make time for these five sessions a week, I'd say, but they don't need to be more than 3 to 4K, but a lot of intensity in there, I think. 